All right, Collector 007 here with another item from Timo. And if you guys haven't heard about Timo, it's basically like the uh, new Amazon of China, except it's now worldwide. And uh, if you go to the websites, it almost seems too good to be true, some of the items that they have on there. So if you watch some of my other videos, like I picked up jackets that were literally one was two dollars and seventy cents for a lightweight winter jacket um i've picked up like hats like you know um peaky blinder style caps for 2.99 um you could get boots motorcycle accessories gloves there, there's a million things and the first time i placed the order which was maybe about nine months ago uh, you know i was a little skeptical but i paid through paypal and about seven or eight days later, I got the first item in the mail and uh, they asked me if I wanted to be an affiliate and I'm like, sure. So basically by being an affiliate and I'm gonna leave a link below, um, you, you get money loaded onto an account and you could use that money to purchase whatever you want. And depending on um, how many videos you do, um, you know, that's how much money they give you. So I'm on the lowest tier because, quite frankly, I don't have that much time uh, to do this. But um, when I do, I just pick some things. And uh, recently I got a Bluetooth uh, tire pressure uh, apparatus for my motorcycle wheels, which I'll be doing as soon as I have a, a chance. Um, and that's something um, that, you know, by looking at my cell phone, I could check the tire pressure on my motorcycle. And uh, I got that. And in the same order, I got this knife. And I only got this knife because it looked really cool. So this is basically what you called a fishing knife or a uh, boating knife or a kitchen knife or what I'm gonna use it for is a stash knife. So stash knives are knives that you keep strategically hidden around your house or around your property. And you know, they're not expensive bench-made knives or Chris Reeves or something like that that you wanna leave outside. Um, they're, they're knives that are inexpensive, but in a uh, perilous situation, they can get you you know out of uh, out of harm and into safety so this knife was uh, I believe it was like seven dollars again I'm gonna leave a link below but for seven dollars you get this um, they're calling it a leather sheath and it feels like leather to me I can't tell if it's leather or PVC but it, it's kind of decent it's got this little strap on it here so I guess you could put it through your belt if you were gonna do so um, but um, it's kind of cool and one of the things I did like about it it has this ring on it so like I said if you were let's say hiding this in a shed or a garage you know you could have just a nail and you could just have this hanging by that you don't have to use the sheath you could just you know just have it hanging just by that and um, it's it's there when you need it it does have these little brass rivets on it, it stitching looks you know halfway decent and again it's seven bucks um, and then here's the knife itself now I don't know if you could see that but this thing is razor sharp. Um, one of my grandkids came by the other day and luckily I got to it before he did because um, this thing is literally like a razor. So it's probably not the most expensive steel. It's probably just basic uh, stainless steel on it. But, um, you know, first of all, it's a 5.5 inch blade and it's over 11 inches in length. And it does come with this solid wood um, handle with these brass rivets on it. And it is a full tang, as you can see. It's got these nice little scallops on the side here, and it's got that wicked, wicked point there, if you could see that. I mean, that is just sharp as heck. That is one good looking knife. It has a, like a false edge over here. It's got like um, a really a deep grind on it. Very, very pointy, very, very stabby. Um, you could hold it, and again, it has this ring here. So if you were using it in a situation, you could almost use it like that and reverse and put your finger through that ring just like that. And this would definitely take care of business for the bad guy, that's for sure. But let's hope, you know, that never happens. And that's it. But so this, again, you could use this in your kitchen if you want. You cut steaks, you cut chicken, you could cut turkey, you cut fruit. Um, it's good to, you know, hook outside on your barbecue, barbecue grill. Um, you know, if you have little tabs on the side of your grill like I do, you could just hang that outside if you wanted to. And uh, I don't think it would rust because it is stainless steel. So, you know, obviously not in the sheath. But um, that's it. Just a quick look. Again, I'm very impressed with the products um, from Timo. Otherwise, I wouldn't be talking about them. And again, they're not the highest end products. You know, for $7, I'm sure there is, um, you know, knives that uh, for 
boating and fishing and camping that obviously um, costs a lot, lot more than that and maybe are higher quality. But um, for $7 with the sheath, um, including shipping, I can't see how you could go wrong. So uh, just taking a quick look from something from Timo. And thanks for watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And again, I'm going to leave the links in the description below. All right. Thanks for watching.